Hey Triple T crew, welcome back to my channel. Thank you for stopping by, thank you for watching. Sorry for the car noises in the back. Um, I I had a thought, right? I was driving, I had a thought. And I, I realized, you know, we always say we are more than conquerors through Christ Jesus. So, what do what does it mean to be a conqueror though right so we're more than conquerors through christ jesus but what allows us to be conquerors right is it that we conquered um a specific situation that we were put in by you know um maybe say let's use an example so maybe you're at work, right? And you, your boss says something insensitive or rude or somebody even at work says something insensitive and rude to you. And you answer them back, right? Um, do you think that you are being a conqueror in that situation because you you answered them back right so in your own power in your own strength you answer them back and you tell them off and tell them your mind and you know in yourself if you're satisfied because you tell them your mind you tell them off and everything right so do you believe that you are a conqueror in that situation right so as you're listening to me talk you can type in the chat do you believe in that situation you are more than a conqueror right I say no. One who I'm say no? So no. Why I'm say no is that if we are saying that we are more than conquerors, right? Through Jesus Christ, right? You think Jesus Christ would have answered back that person in such a manner? Right? Because we're more than conquerors through Jesus Christ. So we have to think about what would Jesus want us to do, right? So I believe the correct way would be to ignore that person, leave that person to do whatever they want to do with their shenanigans, right? The person says something to you, you don't answer them, you ignore them, right? And you 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 find a corner and you say a little prayer and you pray, right? You pray, just leave it in God's hands, right? Right then and there, you conquer the situation. Because you speak the word that you are more than a conqueror through Christ Jesus. So therefore, you just conquered that situation because you gave it to Jesus, right? And I want us to think about that scripture that way. We are conquerors when we give Jesus the situations, right? We're conquering the situations when we give it to Jesus because we can handle the situations. We'll make a mess of the situation, right? Same example, you go and you answer back that person and that person answer you back and you get into an altercation at work. Now, you're in a position where you're about to lose your job. You have children, you have a family, right? And now you're in this altercation and you're on the verge of either being suspended Meaning that's taking money out of your pocket or you're going to be fired, which permanently takes money out of your pocket, right? So if you had given that situation to God, which was the second option, right? Then you would realize that God would now take care of it because God knows that you have children, right? God knows you have a family to feed, but God also know that you are human and that you had it in your mind and you had it in your, in your mouth to say back to the person but you held your peace you demonstrated to God that you have self control you demonstrated to God that you are able right to give it to him and leave it in his hands right so I say if you are able to leave situations to God give it to him pray about it leave it in his hands don't take it up on yourself to go you know answer this person or 
do this to the person or revenge the person because the Lord said vengeance is mine. So you take that up on yourself now and go and figure do that. Then you're not conquering the situation. You're putting yourself in the situation and you're making it worse. So I just want to leave that with you today. When we say we are more than conquerors through Christ Jesus, you have to remember that it's through Christ Jesus we're going to conquer, right? So we have to think about the through Christ Jesus part, right? Meaning that we're going to leave that situation in his hands for him to take care of it. So we have already, we have already overcome by putting it in his hands. You understand? Because if you take it up on yourself, you, the situation is overtaking you, right? And you can't deal with that situation, right? Because it's way past your limit. So when you're able to give that situation to God, leave it in his hands, you have already conquered, all right? So I just want to leave that with you today. I love you. I love you, I love you, I love you. But I know for sure Jesus loves you more, all right? Blessings, blessings, and more blessings. Bye-bye.